Chapman. Is it two ducks fly upside down here because there's nothing worth crapping on? Moving on. And this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Blitzburg Steelheads battle. The Cleveland Burns. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. And then these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. going to be explosive this week. He meant it literally. <laughs> Second down and ten. What are you trying to replace you? It looks like the coach is ripping that play from the playbook. What a dud. Ten. He picks up a two. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. Oh, man. Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I got to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. First down and long, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down and a mile. Five on that play. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Oh, and the defender cut off that pass like a suburban. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck! Yeah. 
and it's first and ten. Whenever a player gets big like this, it reminds me he was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. And no other said, never hit a man when he's down. He's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. Second down and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He's at the 30. He's running out of gas now. The 10. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. First and ten. I don't know whose eyes they... Oh, with the punishing hit! First and ten. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. With the brutal hit. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Well, uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. Man, what a hit that was. Second down in a very lot. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. First down and five. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Hey. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. <laughs> a 
The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback just like that. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he just, and they went to the air and came up big. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. And out comes the most underrated position in football. The mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball and hits upfield. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. shots like that over your career? Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And that's another... Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had shown off today. Looks like it's a good fit. And it's first and ten. Well, he made the pass, but then a space by... Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot! That's why we love the MFL! First down and six. Oh, he just got crushed. And that'll bring up second and one. And with an, oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a lick. Oh, nice hit. First and ten. And another interception. 
interception. This quarterback is, whoa, oh, that is one big mutant sandwich down there. One guy's definitely toast. That's what you call a club sandwich, Grim. And it's first and ten. Put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Boom! <laughs> and it's first and ten. He just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go! He's unstoppable! <laughs> Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. They're getting on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a shop up right now. This isn't the devil brick, it's just one of them. Oh, that don't make it any less scary. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Brex. Uh, goodnight to that guy, Brex. You're an idiot. And he's up. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game. Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on a bench. He probably cramped his pants. First down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. First and ten. Oh, he just cremated that guy. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. Yeah, 
The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. I turned out the light, it wasn't a fraud in my bed. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. And it's two minutes left in the half. I can't wait to the halftime show. Second down and nine. the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her raw intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. They stumped the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. And that's another turnover for the... Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? The defense is running low on line bashers. They have only two left. You need to play smart from here on out. That's defense, Grim. You're asking too much of them. And it's first and ten. Ah, uh, come on, man. You gotta catch that. I don't catch anything, Grim. I'm retired. Second down and ten. team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stomped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the, the quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. Second down and seven. Hot. Hot one. Two, and he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And that's why he's on defense, schmuck. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one. Eight. That would have been a disappointing run. It's even a worse throw. The defense calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Oh, nice hit. And it's 
It's first and ten. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh boy, where are we going, Grim? Our carnival? Huh? I'm gonna go to our strapeze show, where are we going? Hey, why don't you settle down, just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. shooting down rumors. Second down and ten. The defender's one speed just kicked in. He's so fast, he could run the kick off for a touchdown before the ball was even kicked. <laughs> Third down and, well, good luck. Hot one, hot two. Watching out for that dirty trick. <laughs> and they'll line up for the punt here. They let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. The Cleveland Burns got their asses kicked and handed to them today and lose by forfeit. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chunks choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that was beautiful. <laughs> Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. They get it right 